Hey everybody, welcome to Inquisitor Martyr Warhammer 40k. The first of a few Warhammer games you'll be seeing on the channel in the next week or two. We'll be playing this, another Warhammer 3 campaign, hopefully, and Rogue Trader. Because uh, Grimhammer the mod came out for Warhammer 3, finally, and that's what I want to concentrate on. So, the Sigmar's Errors thing kind of got made into a single mod review, and we'll be taking a Grimhammer campaign and making that the main campaign here, hopefully on Wednesday or Thursday this week. So, uh, yeah. Uh, videos have been a bit slow the last week because I've been sick. I'm, I'm just over being sick, so ready to get back into it here. We're going to be playing the new Sororis class, the Battle Sister class. So I'll be playing as the Sister Celestian, probably? Yeah, I like the Hand Flamer, so... We'll play as that one, and we're gonna name our character Sororites. Haha. -ha. So this is the new class. I got a free copy of the DLC, so I could showcase the, uh... Sororites class. I don't know why they're level 5, but okay. Probably could, oh, because I switched, uh, skipped the tutorials. Right, all right, play. So this new class is available for everyone at $14.99 uh, for the DLC. So if you want to get it for yourself, you can. Um, I played a little bit of it and I deleted the characters so we could play it together. Uh, and I've enjoyed playing this uh, Battle Sister so far, so yeah. Video should be back to somewhat normal Monday through Friday here. I hope uh, now that I'm over being sick, I'd like to get back to normal. Um, but my backlog has been exhausted for some series like Midnight Suns. I only have one left. Uh, Rimworld, I have none left. We got to get some Rimworld done and ready for you guys. Uh, this. So, I mean, there's still things I got to get caught back up on against the storm. So there are things that need to be caught up on. Uh, but on my Twitter, I'm going to be doing a top 10 games of the year. Uh, thing because I didn't I did want to do a video but I got sick and I don't want to take too much time to make that video now so just hop on over my Twitter same name is here and you'll be able to see one a day of my top 10 favorite games of the year starting tomorrow the 14th of December and we'll be playing a story game high on life I've been waiting all year for that one so we'll be playing a story game here every Wednesday, so the schedule's gonna change around a little bit But I think everyone will be happy with the schedule once it gets changed around I was gonna change around towards the end of the year All right So let's see what do we want to do first I think we just need to go to the star map, probably. I don't see any things. Let's check our character. We've probably got some things to do. We got two available points because we did the tutorial. Let's add a point to both of those. Passives. Let's. Add a point to we have four passive skill point. Let's add one to movement speed. Let's add one to warfare. Or maybe we should add it to ranged combat. Yeah, maybe that's a better idea. Acts of fate. So let's add one to sacred right effectiveness and one to energy shield efficiency. Nothing in our inventory that we can upgrade to, so I think we're good to go. Let's do a mission. Realization campaign mission. Let's do this one. It's a level 5 mission, so I think we can handle it just fine. Relay Station Campaign Mission. 
the Nurgle mission. It's on normal difficulty for this first one. I arrived at the St. Abelard Astropathic Relay Station to find Metrodora Tholema, a skilled major's biologist conducting important research new in a recent outbreak of a mysterious epidemic. The Void Station is, however, in lockdown and all communication channels are cut off. We are detecting a strong chaos presence. I'm entering the station to find out the fate of the Madras Biologist. Inquisitor, the epidemic that spread through the relay station was just the prelude to a full-scale chaos infestation. The Void Station is in total lockdown until the decontamination teams and the Imperial Guard troops arrive, and that could take time. Quarantine doesn't concern me, Captain. Think of me as decontamination crew and support team in one. Do you really believe that the Magos Biologus you seek is there? Alive? There are still people on the station. Metrodora Thelema is a sacred priest of the Omnissiah. I believe she can take care of herself. All right, so let's do it. Oh yeah, I like this. I like the flamethrower. I like this flamethrower. I was playing a different class last time I played this the Sister Sorority. The Sorority's class. Hello, nerdlings. Just burns up these lower level things. I love it. Let myself heal back up here. Turn our map mini map on. the heat of the gun, man. The heat of the gun does stuff to him. Inquisitor, if you don't mind me asking, why are you so sure this Caius Thorn could help your investigation? He is a space marine, a legendary defender of the Imperium. It makes him the most important member close to Heinz Retin. Even if their relationship was as strained as it seems, he must have been very close to the Lord. Let's kill that guy. And he could have knowledge of important details. So that little bar down there is overheat. Gotta make sure we watch that. Supply was in here. Nothing that we can use right now. Okay. Let's keep going then. I like to explore the whole map. I was talking about this on my stream the other day. I like exploring the whole map on these missions. There's always nice little tidbits of surprises. That was an easy room. Much easier than I expected it to be from where we are on the mission. Alright, there you go. There's another wave right here. And they are uh, gone. Oh, there's more. I just have a better flamethrower than you. That's all that is. They have a flamethrower, I have a flamethrower, and I'm just better than them.
Inquisitor, I have completed the task you gave me. There is no trace of the Martyr anywhere in the logbooks of my ship. This ship is ancient, and has traveled everywhere in the sector, and still, nothing. I suspected that much. It was worth a try. I wish I had the treasured logbook of my rogue trader clan. It has been in the possession of my family since my ancestor received the warrant of trade. What happened to that logbook? It has disappeared when the Inquisitorial Purge destroyed the clan headquarters. It is indeed quite unfortunate, Captain. The moment of retribution is here. Alright, so we're going to go back down here. I think up is the way we're supposed to go. But I just want to see what's down here first. I mean, tick damage does a number on these guys. Oh, there's one more down here. Come here, dude. Give me the credits. I like money, so I need the credits. Pretty straightforward mission so far. I'm not complaining with the progress of this one. Let's keep moving up the map. Oh, that's a lot of mobs. Oh, some are nerglings, though. Yeah, they just went down so easy. Give me what's in this chest, please. Thank you. Oh, that's that's good. That's good stuff. This is probably the archives right here. Yep. Or something. Last defensive perimeter collapse. Loss of the base is imminent. Lord Commissar Baron has fallen. I took command of the reigning force in the librarium as the ranking officer of the astropath quarters confirmed his loss. I ordered Bravo Squad to retrieve the survivors, but their chances from the hostile activity in the void dock are minimal. As, this, as of this moment, Tempestus Garrison Saint Abelard has ceased to function as a fighting entity. I shall follow the standard Exodus protocol. The Emperor protects. So that was not the main archives. Okay. All right, good. Supply and medical. Our inoculators fall off, so we don't need that right this moment. Inquisitor, our Argor readings have suddenly spiked to alarming levels. You've reached the center of the chaos infestation. Stay alert. Are we gonna have waves of mobs here to deal with? Let the tick damage take some of these things down so I don't waste my so I don't overheat near as fast. You're in the archives, Inquisitor. 
try to find a cogitator that can grant you access to the data vaults. That was easy with the flamethrower. Way too easy, actually. Probably could run this on a higher difficulty, but eh. This is the central cogitator of the station. If this Magus Barlogus tried to send a report to her superiors, it must be logged here. This is Meteor Thema, recording my message for Atapath's transmission. Not gonna read all of this. I missed the Magus Barlogus on the station. I logged the three potential destinations where I could find her. I hope she's worth all this trouble. And there's the, there it is. We finished it. Have we found every... Have we done every room? I think we have. We've done every room on the mission. So we can go ahead and click the quick button. Head back to the manufacturum and... See what uh, kind of upgrades we can do before I wrap up this episode. Level six, let's go and do our character thing. We have one passive skill point. Do that increased area f effect our inventory. So that is worse. We're gonna sell that. That's better, so we're gonna keep or install the old one. Uh, that is worse. That can be deleted. That can be. Now that can be deleted. Uh, that one's worth quality. Equip that one. All right. Let's head on over to the store and sell all this good old junk for money. And that's going to do it for today. So if you enjoyed this episode of Inquisitor, make sure to leave a like on it, subscribe, turn on the notification bell, and I'll see you next time for more here on Sierra Santiago.